Hey guys, what's up, it's Elp here. Welcome back to the channel. Now, Apple has just released today an update for iOS 15. Yes, iOS 15.6.1 has now become available. And of course, in this video, we're going to go over everything that's new within the latest iOS 15.6. Now, this is something that's normal. Apple, although they're focusing most of their attention for iOS 16 dropping here in the next month or so, iOS 15 will continue to get updates. And in this video, we're going to go over exactly what's new with the latest iOS 15.6. Point one. And now, as always, if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS news and Apple software updates, of course, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode. Now, aside from iOS 15.6.1, Apple has also updated iPadOS, iPadOS 15.6.1, macOS 12.5.1 has now been released for the Mac, watchOS 8.7.1 released for the Apple Watch, and for the Apple TV, we did not receive any update now as i mentioned this software update is a security improvement and you need to update your device as soon as possible if you would like to stay of course protected and secure on the latest os now keep in mind ios 15 is going to be the last update on most devices including iphone 7 models and some ipads so they will continue to release these patches as ios 16 and 15 continue to progress over time now there's currently two major issues being addressed here with ios 15.6.1 and by the way this is for all devices running iOS 15, rather is a new or an old device, it is recommended for you to update. The first one is a kernel issue, as you can see right here. An application may be able to execute arbitrary code within kernel privileges. And Apple was made aware of this issue and it might have been used in a while. So this could be something that could be impacting you, rather you know it or not. So it is recommended for you to update. As you can see right here, Apple has obviously patched it within iOS 15.6.1. And we also have a WebKit issue here as well again for all devices new and old running ios 15.6 15.6.1 is addressing an issue that processing maliciously crafted web content may lead to arbitrary code execution again apple uh, was made aware of this and this was actively being used in the wild as well so it is recommended for you to patch these two issues with ios 15.6.1 the software is approximately 100 to 200 megabytes give or take depending on the device that you're updating but it is a quick update a quick patch important patch for many users make sure you go ahead and update to the latest ios 15.6.1 by the way the latest build number there it is 19g82 so you guys have it just a quick update on the latest software update just to keep you guys updated on what's happening thank you for watching guys and i'll see you on the next one peace